some in St. Martinville are enjoying Thanksgiving a little early. Today, a community dinner was held at the Sterling Alexander Community Center. Our Jordan Libicott reports on how the event is all thanks to one St. Martinville family. For the last 16 years, Ethel Francois has been hosting her annual Thanksgiving dinner. Along the way, she's received some help from her family. One day my mom called me up and she said, you know what, she said, I want to feed the elderly people, people that maybe that's homeless, not going to have a Thanksgiving meal. She said, I would like to do it like one week before Thanksgiving. And years later, the guest list has grown. Some folks can't afford it and some can't physically do it anymore. The list of volunteers has grown too. The Francois family now receives donations from their church and people in the community. Each and every year there is someone that's going to show up that's not a and so year after year, this keeps me going, and now it's moved on to my daughter. Shamika Meek started helping her family with the event in 2005. Two years prior, she knew how it felt not to know where her next meal was coming from. In 2003, I was in store Hope Shelter myself, and I needed people to be there for me, so I don't mind helping out other people. Meeks and her family also deliver meals to the elderly to ensure everyone enjoys a Thanksgiving. Just seeing they smile when they come to the door, you know, they care give whoever they're with them at their house. It just light brightens your day up. In St. Martinville, Jordan Lippincott, KTC TV3.